Travis from Tombstone Diesel in Castle Rock, Colorado. We're going to start today by talking about Ford fuel systems. So obviously, you know, the 6.7 has got a lot of issues uh, from cavitation, debris, the CP4 failure, the filtration, all of it needs some a lot of work. Um, so with this one, we actually wound up going into the fleece filter system for the engine bay filter and then also in front of the fuel tank. So fleece has got a lot of awesome components for the fueling system on these newer Fords. What's really cool too, though, is that they integrated the spin-on filters. So instead of dealing with that plastic cartridge that always breaks, and then the uh, in the bed area where you know you're waiting on a filter off back order or any kind of issues like that, you know this makes it super easy to replace. It makes it really efficient. You're dealing with a really great micron writing, uh, being a Donaldson filter. But the billet fleece parts that they created for these, they're, they're just amazing. You know, fleece performance is always really. They, they get to the punch quickly. Uh, when it comes to a new truck, they're constantly doing renditions. They're constantly looking at this thing, say, hey, can we, how can we do that better? Uh, we work a lot with fleece performance. We choose all their fueling stuff, uh, especially on the Ford 67, because all of their stuff is just really engineered to the point of, you know, it's going to work. Customers are happy. It makes for quick service. But then also on the serviceability side, it, it, it makes it more available to actually get your parts. So factory Ford filters, like I said, they're plastic. They're going to a Donaldson filter spin base. Um, with the bed tank system, it was really cool. They were able to integrate that water and fuel sensor still utilizing the factory connector. So a lot of kits, you know, you're running a secondary filter system and you're doing away with that. At least with theirs, they're allowing you to still communicate with that factory dash saying, hey, we have water in our fuel. Okay, change your filter, you know, inspect your fuel, find out what's going on with the debris. But going past that, the filtration of these components it is actually allowing you to save that CP4 a little bit longer. Obviously, we still recommend going into the DCR conversion. So we'll be doing another video later on on the DCR conversion. I'm sure you guys know about those. However, we're going to do an in-depth install to show you actually why they're better, how they work. But first name of the game is your filtration. So even if you don't have a DCR, the fleece performance kits, they're, they're awesome for any Ford from 11 to current. They've got fitment across the board. Uh, all their fueling system, is, it's all billets. Everything is just hand, you know, it's wonderfully machined. Um, all the parts that come out of that facility are just bar none perfect. So we always choose fleet performance on all of our fuel system needs, uh, especially for a Ford. So if you've got a Ford truck and you're local to Castle Rock, Colorado, come by and see us. We've got a lot of options for you 